have a, uh, I can tell by the argument I got in. Well, it wasn't an argument. Oh, what happened? What's I was up? at the one cent frame sale at Aaron Brothers on Sunday. You know, you, you buy one picture frame, you get another picture frame free. All right, all right. Some that take part in the one cent sale. You know. <laughs> guy in front of me, about six three, okay. good looking guy, maybe 180 pounds. All right. Lakers shirt, big muscles. All right. He's got his little picture frame like this. Right. So he's standing there waiting to pay for it. How you doing? How you doing? Hey, the guy. You know, he goes, uh, hey, how do you uh, hang these? And I said, oh, well, you know when you buy a picture in the little metal thing, you get two nails? All right, all right. I said, we put the two nails in the top here. And he goes, oh. Oh, well, they do that for me here? I, go, oh. I said, no, when you get home, just take a hammer. He goes, oh, I don't have a hammer. Oh, how can you not have a hammer? Hey, look at this guy's like 6'3", the muscle. You don't know how to, he goes, oh, no, I'm going to have the guy do it. What? What is that? <laughs> what guy here does not have a hammer? Look, every man here has a hammer. Thank you. Every man should have a hammer. Thank you very much. All right. Thank you very much. Folks, it's Monday night. Time for a headline. <laughs> Kev, I know you're a vegetarian, but this oh, will yeah. change your mind. Oh, Look at this. Oh. Meat from diseased animals Ooh. approved for consumption. Oh. Look at it. New rules classify tumors and open sores as aesthetic problems. Ah, <laughs> oh, that's... Hey, yeah, give me a double tumor with cheese on it, then. <laughs> Here's just a typical bad headline. Times will be good if they don't turn bad. <laughs> Here you go. Children invited to eat pizza with poo. Mm. <laughs> outstanding attendance. There's Lawrence. He was outstanding attendance. Perfect attendance is won by Abby Crager, who was absent. <laughs> you know, I looked at this picture and I said, why did they send me this? Is it the story? Is it the headline? And the more I looked at the picture, I realized, oh my God, the kid has three hands. <laughs> your opinion, the question, would you approve or disapprove of wireless tower, uh, telephone towers in your neighborhood? I like Radford Mitchell. Well, that stuff causes cancer, man. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Unlike that thing in his mouth. You know, a dad is so... We downplay the role of dads in our society, but dads are very important. Here's the, on the street, uh, what's the worst advice you ever got from your dad? Here's John Dover. He says, my dad's advice is always pretty good. He told me not to piss uphill or into the wind or on an electric fence. Yeah. <laughs> Usually involves urination, his advice. <laughs> Here's the most honest photo caption I've ever seen. Can, there's a photo, look at the caption. Blah, 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 blah. You know, I feel sorry when bad things happen to people, but, you know, sometimes, I'm sorry, you know, it's your own fault. I mean, this is, luckily no one was killed here, but, uh, okay, I'm going to read the story. Cincinnati District Fire Chief Anson Turley said the fire was probably started by a cigarette Mrs. Bingham was smoking as she changed her oxygen tank. <laughs> Is Candace Bergen. Candace Bergen grew up as the son of the famous ventriloquist. And what a lovely artist rendering of Candace Bergen. Apparently that looks like the white Aunt Jemima, actually, is what that is. The white Aunt Jemima. That's what it looks like. Who is that? Candace Bergen is beautiful. Look at that. Who is that? Doesn't look like Candace Bergen. What are these? Self-storming doors. <laughs> Explain this to me. Naturally, artificially flavored. <laughs> what planet are people from? Senior Troop 891 traveled to London. 
Here's eight pieces of golden fried chicken, two breasts, two legs, two thighs, two wings, and two chicken lips. <laughs> First of all, that's ten pieces. They can't cook and they can't add. Just idiots. <laughs> There's the tailgate step. Helps mother-in-law to her seat. Really? You keep your mother-in-law in the back of the truck, do you? Now, I hear the cops playing, playing tricky, trying to catch somebody. Found expensive set of bolt cutters left by the burglar at construction site. To claim, please call Topeka Police Chief. There's firewood, look, from trees. This guy's in no hurry. Found cat, 50-50, black and white, very skittish. Been here for about two years. Look at the photo. Common sense in dealing with flashers. <laughs> you think they know this when they put these kind of headlines? Do you think they really don't know what they're doing? Clinton. <laughs> You think they don't know what they're doing, huh? <laughs> we have some weddings. These are people who are deeply in love, who just happen to have interesting names that are getting married. Here's the break a glass wedding. There's the right left wedding. There's the love champion wedding. <laughs> I like this one. Farmer to marry plant. <laughs> There's the gory butcher wedding. I like this one. Look, folks, it's the macaroni and cheese wedding. <laughs> How about this one? It's the went attaway. It's the go and get her wedding. <laughs> hey, what's this all about? This is the crap deal wedding. <laughs> this guy's smiling because he's at the King Woody wedding. <laughs> it's the Wiener Whipple wedding. <laughs> How about the Riding Butts wedding? <laughs> and last but not least, it's the Wacker Daily wedding, ladies and gentlemen. Okay. Headlines, take care of the Tonight Show with Jay Leno, 3000 West Alameda Avenue, Burbank, California, 91523. You can find all of our headlines and other Tonight Show stuff at NBC.com. We'll be right back with John Bon Jovi right after this.